Yo, what's up guys, Dylan's Fishing here. So, um, today guys, just gonna have, sorry I haven't been uploading for ages. I just haven't got the time to. Yeah, so, I'll be showing you, you know, a few things in the tackle box and so what. So, this is like a video for what's in my tackle box. So yeah, we've got some short catch um, jigs, them ones. You can see, I don't know if you can see that. Then oh, we got we got some gulp uh, eight three inch swimming mullet in fluoro pink. Them ones. Then we've got some uh, fluoro. Uh, Z Men grubs in watermelon red. Them ones. I'll get them, I'll get all these out a couple years after. Then I've got this vibe, random vibe that's in there. Um, then we've got some Savage Gear cranker crabs. I think. Or the no, they're the 3D manic crabs. Them ones. Oh, you can't really see them. I'll show you after. That's them. Now, I'll show you these while you're here. So, what we've got, we've got a nice little vibe here. That one. Nice little vibe. Focus. Nice colour on it. Now we've got some Z Man grubs. Them ones. These are really good material, guys. Um, if I had to get any soft plastics, I'd get Z Man. They're one of my favourite soft plastics to use. Next, we've got this Berkeley Gulp uh, 3 inch swimming mullet in um, pink. Which is more like a hot pink. That's them ones. I don't really want to get them out of the pack because I haven't opened the packet yet. That's them. And that's them bait jigs. And these are these Savage Gear crabs. Get one out. And we'll put these down for a second. These. That's what they are. They're like a, that's how they sit, like a, they have a little weight at the bottom. You got your two little, your actual soft plastic, the crab is soft, but you've got your hook and there's a weight there, that looks like a bottom of a crab, and that's them. And then, now I'll put these back up on the tripod and we'll sh I'll show you the rest. I'm sorry, I've got to get the tackle trays out now, guys. So, in this first tackle tray, actually, I might just hold, this, hold the cameras. So in this first tackle tray, what we've got, we've got swivels. There's some small hooks in there. We've got more hooks, more hooks, more hooks. And then I've got jig heads. And we've got a little e-card there. That one, it's not much in there. This is mostly half of my lure. That's a spinner bait. That's a spinner bait with no... Um, Thing on it. The other thing there's a few old soft plastics, metal lure, squid jig. Then I've got that gold one, and I've got that one. It's a pretty big lure. I haven't caught any fish on them. Lost one of the lures. And now I think this is 
Yeah, this is a soft plastic slash sinker box. So we've got little crawl fish, crayfish imitation there. Let's see if I can get close up or focus on that. There you go. I haven't actually put that on a jig head yet, but I reckon that'd be a good for like in freshwater creeks. Um, split shots, more sinkers, more sinkers. And this stuff's good when you ever, whenever you buy squidgies, buy this stuff because this is um, S factor. You get it in the, this little tube, or you can get it in a bigger tube. Got a little red worm, a few little soft plastics. These are the squidgies. I don't know what that one. I don't know the name of them. That's this is the sandworm color. That's a something. Then I've got these fluoro yellow ones. And that's it. And that one, and that's pretty much it, guys. So, yeah, that's it, really. Like, I haven't been uploading for a while because I haven't had the time to. But, you know, probably about a few weekend, a few weeks or something, um, I'll, I'll be he heading out to Mugra, Mugra Dam, and we'll go bass fishing. So, yeah, we'll try that out, and... Got a few of that, and I'll, I don't know if I've showed you my new rig, but I got it for Christmas. It's a um, Shimano Sienna, 7 foot, but what I've done, I've tucked it on a, another rod. I've taken the rod off, it was, was a Shimano 7 foot. Yeah, 7 foot, and I put a Jarvis Walker rod on it because it's just a bit shorter until I get another rod. But yeah, I'll show you the setup. That's the Shimano Sienna. She's a bit had it already, but she still puts me through. Like that. I th it's 12 pound braid on there, I think. Yeah, 12 pound braid. And then I've got a Jarvis Walker Storm Rider 6 foot spinning uh, rod. And I've got a nice little spinner bait on there. Yeah, that's that's a rod. It's a good little rod, and um, yeah, good little rod, and um, yeah, I've caught a few fish on it. Yeah, um, so when we go out bass fishing, I'll be sure to film that for you. Um, yeah, sure. Hopefully, get a few bass, and if we do, we might do a bass captain cook, which I don't really like keeping bass. Cause, so, cause how good they are. Oh, good looking and beautiful and that. Just put them back, catch and release. There's so much fun fighting. Yeah. Um, if you want to go, you can go check out um, Daily and Dylan's Fishing. That's our other channel. This is my channel, Dylan's Fishing. Daily and Dylan's Fishing, which is um, pretty good. We've got about six or seven videos on there. We've got a, uh, we've got pike catch and cook. We've got brim catch and cook. We've got Hope Island brim catch and cook. We've got mud crab catch and cook on there. Yeah, just go check it out, guys. Give a like and subscribe to the, the channel. And yeah, we'll leave it at that. And like and subscribe this video. 